All right, we're back at the table in uh, drill bit selection. Um, as yesterday when I was at Harbor Freight, I found these left-handed drill bit set, which is cool. I hope they're cobalt. I don't know. Doesn't really tell me. They're left-handed drill bits. And here's where a little product improvement can be made for Harbor Freight, this Warrior brand 12-piece um, screw extractor set. Now, the extractors, I'm, I'm hoping they're strong enough. It would be great if they were cobalt steel. You could search the world over and any machinist will tell you cobalt steel is the way to go. Now, to, since we don't have liquid cooled, you know, drill motors, uh, here we go, drill motor. Um, the best way to go is titanium nitride. So, you know, try and, they take uh, cobalt steel, make drill bits, and then they coat them with titanium nitride, and that makes it to where the temperature that it can take is, is way up there. It's like 1200 degrees. So, you can run it hot, and it will not go dull too quickly anyway. So, I buy this set. This extractor set, and what do we have here? Right-handed, non-coated, regular drill bits. That's a bummer. What I'd recommend they do is take cobalt steel, left-handed threads, and then coat them nit titanium nitride. Put it in this one kit, and we will be better off. All right, so here's the drill bit that I broke from a set a really really old set but that's the first one I ever broke uh, luckily um, Dremel comes with a, uh, a little bit that you install on the uh, Dremel and you can actually sharpen your, with a wheel you can actually sharpen your drill bit so I'll do that later I'm not going to show you how to do that you can read about it but uh, right now I was just uh, talking about a little bit of product improvement ideas and you know we always have room for improvement so these are probably the drill bits that I'm gonna try using um, I'm not too thrilled with these especially that's that's hardened steel uh, bolt that's uh, stuck in there so that it's not gonna be any good so we'll, we'll see what we can do all right talk to you soon